sense it's APM Group's fault because in the 1990s, just after I finished my involvement with the launch of Prince 2, uh, back in 1st of October 96, Richard Farrow approached me and asked if I'd like to come on board and set up the, help set up the accreditation system with uh, Colin Bentley. And my role was as lead assessor through the 90s, and I found myself visiting all these weird and wonderful training organisations and assessing trainers. And I met some really great trainers. And I began to dream, uh, what if I could create an organisation someday um, where I populated it entirely with great trainers using great material? Well, I couldn't do that while I was an assessor. But when we formed the company in 91, that's, that's what I set out to do. And it's been great fun. Fundamentally, it's an issue of evidencing independently business discipline. We have a very exciting set of customers to service. We're in a very exciting market where the key issue, for example, of the UK competing on a world stage is the competence of its knowledge workers in a context of rapid change. And we're equipping uh, our customers to do that. Now, a lot of people are attracted to training as a profession, but there are some very poor products out there. What I am pleased with is when I can say to customers and potential customers, we're an APM Group accredited organization, it means something. It means that our organization has been scrutinized and has come out as being a, a professional one. Uh, that uh, our material's been assessed, that it's adequate and complete, and perhaps more than that, it meets certain learning objectives, and that um, the individual trainers are up to standard. Even I, I'm still in the game. <laughs> Occasionally my colleagues let me go out and uh, they allow the old man to do some training, and I'm allowed to train in change management, MSP, and P3O. And so I have regular meetings with APM group assessors. And I always find those of value. Uh, even if it's a straight, clean sheet, the assessors always give me back some value and say, yeah, you might like to think about this, and that was good, but have you thought about that? Well, those to me are benefits of accreditation. <laughs>